Virtually everything we use these days depends on some sort of computer. In MATC's Computer Electronics Technology Program, instructor Mark Brucker teaches students how to keep computer hardware and software running smoothly. I actually graduated here, okay, I went to school here, and when I went to see the counselor, I was planning on getting into television, and he said, well, why don't you get into computers? And I said, okay, and that's how I ended up in computers. It's a very difficult field, okay? You have to learn electronics, uh, programming also. That's a very difficult thing to learn. There aren't many places that uh, they teach both the hardware and the software, okay? In this program, we emphasize both the hardware and the software. You can't understand the hardware unless you know the software that makes it do what it's supposed to do. Here at MATC, we allow the students to break down computers all the way down to the, uh, the component level in both the hardware and in the software. They learn how to install, maintain, repair both computers, networks, and um, ne any type of network equipment that might be connected up and peripherals for computers. What we're doing today is we're setting up the computer for next semester uh, for the advanced um, computer systems and the networking classes, which will be the last semester for the computer electronics program. And so what we're trying to do, or what we are doing, is we're putting a second hard drive in the computer so the regular computer systems class can use one hard drive while we use another and then so nobody interferes with the other one's work. So what we're doing is I'm just going to put it in the bay here. With so many businesses and institutions relying on their computer systems, there is steady demand for knowledgeable technicians. Some of the job titles are computer technician, network technician, those are a few of them, and then there's variations on that. Uh, I have uh, graduates that have uh, gone all over the place, some of them to Bell Labs, uh, where they invented, well, those students didn't invent it, it was before they graduated, but they invented uh, Transistor and um, some of the operating systems that are popular today, like Linux. Brucker students learn the skills they will need in this rapidly changing field that has come a long way during his time at MATC.